If you are the type of person who leave within the first 30 seconds of watching any video, I highly recommend just booting up out of here because this video is meant for the people who want to have a one of one part on their Mustang. And with the exception of maybe one other person. I saw one other person online, but that's not the point. Any car person, no matter what car they have, will always question, what can I do to stand out? What can I do to be better? What can I do to be different compared to what everyone else is doing on the internet, at car shows, or even at car meets? And in this video, I'm gonna help you guys along the way of exactly what you need to do in order to make your Mustang stand out from the rest of the crowd, of exactly where to get this part, how to get this part, and the pros and cons about it. And the million dollar question is, where do you get these fog lights? And the answer to that question, you can't. And the reason why you can't is because you can't buy them online, you can't get them from a private seller, you can't get them anywhere. I made this personally for myself, for myself, as a one of one piece. Because I had tinted headlights on this car many years back and I couldn't see absolute jack shit, but I also liked the look of it and I needed something where I was gonna hit some random shit out on the road. Go around, go around! So I found that adding fog lights in the bottom holes of this front bumper was a great way to make it look really, really nice out of the way where you can't even see it, but also give me the best of both worlds where I can be able to see at night without having to sacrifice removing that tint on my headlights, which I ended up doing later on. With this being an item that just truly doesn't exist, and with basic electrical knowledge, I was able to figure this out pretty easily and pretty quickly, believe it or not. And by doing the method that I ended up having right here, I found that there was a lot of pros and cons that went along with it. And if you guys want to see those pros and cons, you got to be able to stick around through the rest of the video. You can find the parts for this on pretty much any website, as in like Amazon, eBay, probably OfferUp, Facebook Marketplace, you name it. Keep the list going in the comment section down below. And all you need in order to make this work is some outdoor LED strips and at least five feet of wire and that is plenty and the reason why i ended up five feet of wire is because if you mess up too many times at least you'll have enough wire in order to continue on and make it work there's a variety of places you're able to hook this up as for me i end up hooking these up to my side marker lights because every time i turn on my headlight switch the fog lights will turn on as well you can also hook this up to an independent switch where it goes straight to the battery or you can do it to an empty fuse inside the fuse box but personally for me i found it easier to hook it up to the side marker switch because the side marker is directly right next to the fog lights and it was just simple as just tapping into the positive and negative over and into the side marker light. The pros about these fog lights is they are very bright and they work very well at night. And what's awesome about these lights and they speak for themselves about how unique and different they are compared to what other Mustangs have out on the road. They're an awesome piece to add to your car because it truly adds character to what the front end really needs to be about on a Mustang. And they definitely give that more modern appeal because a lot of cars on the road already have fog lights on the car and their LEDs. This car doesn't really have any sort of option when it comes to fog lights and if you do get them they're stuck up in the middle of the grill and they just are very bulky and just in the way with these they're hidden out of the way and they look very very nice when you want to turn them on or off and the cons about these lights and there's actually quite a few and i want to touch up with this briefly with you guys so you guys know exactly what you're running into and hopefully make it better than what i have on this car i found that the outdoor led strip lights they work good they're white and bright i see you probably have already noticed this already at the beginning of the video or even during this video is about how these lights are very yellow the oxidation from these lights running constantly and also from the sun as well they just don't give the greatest appeal when the lights are on you don't even notice it but when you have the lights off and it's daytime you clearly notice the yellow oxidation inside these lights and i feel like that's one major flaw that are within these lights that i recommend if you were to go look for a nice set of lights make sure that you do your homework and pick the right set of led strip lights or even something better overall these lights are a great addition to add to your mustang with the exception of some of the flaws that you can easily fix by choosing other brands out there that are going to work a lot better and another downside i've seen about these lights and i haven't experienced this for myself but i've seen that other people who have bought these lights have dealt with it is the fact that sometimes these lights can go out but what i do know if you spend the extra money and really go the extra mile with it i guarantee those lights will look a lot better and have a lot less oxidation and also the lights will probably work a lot better than you anticipate if you like led upgrades and you want more done to your mustang i recommend checking out the card above because i added something to this car that you cannot personally buy and you have to custom make it yourself and it was actually quite easy and with that being said please like comment and subscribe down below and i will see you guys in the next one